Welcome, my friends. So glad you could join me. And today, it's going to be a pretty good day. Welcome, my friends. So glad you could join me. My name is Wonka, and today we're going to be playing some more Car Mechanic Simulator 2018. That's right, we're back. And today is probably going to be one of my favorite episodes. So if you're excited for that, do me a favor, tickle that like button, leave me a comment down below. Let me know that this series is not done because it's, it's starting to die a little bit. So show your support, make sure it stays alive. While you're down there, remember to leave your suggestions for any customization, be it paint, rims, tires, anything you can think of, as well as if you have any plate suggestions for me for the vehicle that we do today. Mod link will be in the description. As always, if you're new here or you haven't already, be sure to subscribe if you're feeling friendly. And without further ado, let's just get into it. I hope you guys enjoy, and I think you will. All right, obviously, first order of business, we got to take care of our Miata. This beautiful thing right here. I'm, I'm really excited, so I'm just going through this really quick. Um, we got the rims. I think was a very good choice. I flipped a coin on the rims. I think it was a great choice on the rims. It fits this car perfect. The yellow, again, fits this car perfect. And I forgot one thing. And just to make it official, we got to add our New Jersey plate. Nice yellow New Jersey plate that says stylist. Because we're a hairstylist, of course. Oh, and I guess we should probably put the put the roof on it for storage. I like that. Oh, and it's a black roof because I didn't put the roof on when we painted it. Accidental, but I like it. So let's uh, move this bad boy on out of here because it's time to get oh to what I've been waiting for since the game was announced to have mod support. That's right, the Nissan Skyline R34. GTR, I don't care what you want to call it, this is the one. The chosen one. You might be like, meh, I'm not really a big fan of this car. Well, I don't care. Because I am, and I'm going to fangirl over this car all episode. And if you don't like it, you can, uh, hit that, you can hit that thumbs down button, and everybody in the comments will boo you. So, just watch. If there's one thumbs down on this, just watch. You're going to get booed. Watch nobody boo, and I'm just going to be like, well, shit. <laughs> oh, man, this is so cool. Got the carbon fiber. We are way back here, though. I hope this isn't how you race in first person. <laughs> Holy stretch over here. Fucking seven foot two Yao Ming sitting in the f R34. Oh, man, this thing is awesome, though. The carbon dash. You got the <laughs> giant giant handbrake oh man I love it all right get me out of here oh man I could just sit here and stare at it for all oh I can't even talk it's like middle school when that hot girl in class asks you for a pencil and you're like I... <laughs> my name Jeff I never thought I'd say that why did I say that I regret everything all right, that's it. I'm I'm done. That's 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 where I quit YouTube. See you later. Um. Okay, wait. No, can't do that. I can't do that. I'm sorry. I tried not to be a sellout, but I'm a sellout. It's hard out here if you're not a sellout. Okay. God. Cut me some slack. What are we working with here? Oh, that's. That's a V8. That's a supercharged V8. Whoa. Little, little known fact, the R34 in this world has a supercharged V8. I mean, it's probably the, the most powerful engine, and since I don't think modders can just, like, say what an engine makes horsepower-wise and stuff, at least yet, I really think they should add that, but that's another, that's another story altogether. 
But since they can't do that yet, I guess maybe that's why we're, we're, we're looking at this engine right now. I'm just prepping it to get torn out. That should be everything. Just thought I'd chat with you guys about that. Got this big frickin' sway bar thing here. It's probably not the correct term for it. I'll probably get some someone correcting me, but that's cool. Knowledge is power, and I'm, I'm not against it. Sorry, don't want to add, want to pull. Beautiful. You do great work. You do, you do real good work. Like, I appreciate that we are going to get more horsepower. But I also feel like people appreciate, you know, the authenticity. Whereas, you know, a supercharged V8, probably pretty rarely seen in a vehicle like this. I don't Could you even fit one in here? Has anybody done that? We want a twin turbo, right? That's, that's what we ordered. It's like placing a delivery pizza order, right? When you order these things. That's how easy it is. No? Someone lied to me. So sorry if some of that was kind of like, like this, you know, kind of like looking through a fog. I'm, I'm trying to work with it here. It's it's real tight down here, but you know what? I'm not complaining because it's it's beautiful. I wouldn't change a thing. Not even that tow hook. Not even that little arrow pointing to the tow hook. I, I wouldn't change anything. Maybe, maybe the rims that were on it. I can't fully remember what rims were on it. I might change those, but other than that, the thing is bloody gorgeous, I tell you, bloody gorgeous. miss the the battery that they relocated in the back there it's just it's just weird to me for a battery to be in the back I know it's I know it's not completely abnormal it's just weird to me I just need to I just need to take a moment here to appreciate the fact that 
am working on a vehicle like this. Even if it's fake, even if these parts are not authentic and it technically isn't really like I'm working on it at all, it feels like I am because the body is what it is. And I'm just, I just need to have a moment here. I feel like I've accomplished something in my life today. Something I thought I never would. Now, if the day comes that I can really work on one of these and it's mine too, whoo, I think, I think that would, if you could bottle that, that is pure happiness in a bottle right there. All right, I wanna get this thing painted, so let's get to it. Again, I forget these steps every time. I think I would learn my lesson, but um, here I am, not learning. I was balancing myself in the process. See, it's like it's like it never happened. There's only one color that this thing can be for the thumbnail at least feel free to keep picking your own colors don't 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 think that i'm saying you can't i thought i may have gone too big on the wheels but you know what i think i went just right i think i got it fitting pretty good first try i'm proud of myself patting myself on the back how am i doing this with two hands three hands four hands who knows how many hands i have I don't need the computer, I need the engine.
moment of truth. Gimme, 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 gimme. It always gets. I don't give a shit about manners when there's an R34 sitting in my shop, god damn it. I might be I might be fangirling a little too hard. I can I can feel the sub buttons. Or the unsub buttons, I should say, being clicked as I, as I do this, but I just I can't help myself. I physically cannot help myself. Oh man, and the red with the red and the red and the red with the blue. Ooh -wee. Oh, if only I could change that white roll cage. It bothers me for some fucking reason. I wish it was just black or something, but whatever. That's fine. Oh. Just, oh. So yeah, leave your suggestions. I mean, if you want to change it from this blue, that's fine. But I had to do it. I mean, it's the most iconic color for it. I think I got pretty close to the color that it is supposed to be, too. Now, I will never, ever... Do such a terrible thing as to start a vehicle like this with no oil. I respect it way too much. That being said, I may or may not have gotten a little, a little overexcited and forgot that this vehicle has no transmission. Minor details. Two whole things in the engine bay here that I completely managed to forget. But they're not very important. I mean, brakes and cooling are definitely not that important. I mean, I can't miss anything at this car. I have to go balls to the walls, max, get everything. Everything. I like these Reptilia R2 seats in this thing. I think it's going to look good. And I did choose the exact same steering wheel, so look at that. Whoever made this mod has good taste in steering wheel, I would say. Am I right, bro? So here we go. Moment of truth. I mean, we know what it's gonna sound like. We've heard this damn engine a thousand times. I don't know if this vehicle is ready to go to the racetrack. It's a fresh mod. It might not be ready for the racetrack. I might have just broke another file. Oh, we're good. It appeared. The seating placement is much nicer here. I like it. Very bulky roll cage. But I like it. I like it. Let's, uh... Hopefully the gauges work. Oh, the gauges work like a charm. Oh man, whoever created this mod, you sir, you're a god. Ooh, 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 she's quick. Oh, she's quick. Okay, I gotta, I gotta get used to that. So we got the slicks in the back. Oh, the racing tires in the front. Oh my god. It's amazing how much speed we get going into this. I mean, one of these I'll do it right, right? I just... Oh! I went in way too hot there, holy. It, it's really hard to judge speed in this game. I keep looking down at the fucking speedometer at the bottom right, because it's kind of hard to read the one in the gauge there. Oh man, and I'm just amazed at how fast I'm going. Holy shit, this thing is sick. I just gotta learn how to control it, that's all. We'll get a good lap, don't you worry. Oh, spin top. <laughs> oh man, she just, she just wants to go sideways. She's born for it. But I gotta try and beat 106. That's a good time, but I gotta try and beat it. Just one time. Just one try. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Beat it for me. Beat it for me. 
Set the new best. There it is, 105. Woohoo, that's pretty good. Oi! <laughs> this thing likes to spin top. It's pretty badass, I gotta say. But that's it, folks. If you guys want to see more Car Mechanic Simulator 2018 in the future, be sure to tickle that like button and leave me a comment down below. Let me know. You guys appreciate this series and you don't want it to end. I say that a lot, I should probably come up with something new to say here, huh? As always, if you're new here, you haven't already, be sure to subscribe if you're feeling friendly and keep your dirty dick beaters off my tools. Take her easy. Make sure you hit that like button, because if you guys hit the like button for me, lots of good things happen, okay? And we can grow and do giveaways and, like, subscribe and all that good stuff, okay? Take a easy. <laughs>